Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And uh, we talked about, of course, the Windows subsystem for Android that is available for Windows 11. And um, that Windows subsystem for Android, of course, works with the Amazon App Store, which limits the amount of apps or what type of apps you can get. Now, I'll share with you guys a article from Neowin website that you can go through. It actually details all the steps required to have the Google Play Store in Windows 11 using the Windows subsystem for Android. Now, this isn't for the faint of heart. It's a complex procedure. I have downloaded the files necessary. We'll be looking at that later today to install it and come back to you with a video talking about how it's, go how it's going and if it's going well. So it's using, of course, the um, principle that the Windows subsystem for Android can run pretty much any Android apps. And uh, it's a procedure that requires you to also have installed the Windows subsystem for Linux. So all of that together will give you, in the end, a working Google Play Store with all the apps within. So I'll share the link. And uh, it's a complex thing, so there's a lot of things to do in here. And it's very, very, very lengthy. You have to follow closely. This is not for the faint of heart because this is a complex thing to do. But um, and in the end, when all of this is done, you should now have a working Google Play Store for um, your enjoyment in Windows. Uh, so check it out. This is, of course, instructions that are taken actually from another website that I've noticed from GitHub that also details the same thing. But um, it enables you to have the Google Play Store available here. So the link to this page is in the description below. You will need a um, software like uh, the 7-Zip software for opening archives uh, in here. And uh, just follow step by step the instructions and exactly what they want you to do. In the end, if successful, you should have a Google Play Store in Windows 11. So it shows you that it's a complete system. It shows you that Windows 11 is capable of running pretty much anything Android. And that it's just a lack of, uh, you know, partnership with Google that just prevents all of this from happening. And uh, so, you know, it's, it's uh, something complex, but it's the way that uh, business works sometimes between companies. So uh, check it out if you want to uh, try it on your PC uh, for Windows 11. Of course, you need to have the requirements. Your system needs to have all the minimum requirements to, hunt, to run the virtual machines, uh, the Android subsystem for Linux and all of uh, for uh, Linux, yes, and all of that. Uh, so check it out and um, follow the instructions. It's, it's a time consuming, it's gonna be long, but you'll be rewarded with a full and real Google Play Store in the end. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching our videos.